Welcome back, everybody. Shares of NVIDIA up 3% today. There's a report that it's in talks to anchor the IPO of chip designer Arm, a long-awaited public listing that would be this year's biggest. Christina Parts and Evelis has more in today's Tech Check. Christina? Well, less than two years ago, NVIDIA tried to buy British chip designer Arm for, what, $40 billion, but failed to do so due to antitrust issues. Flash forward to today, and NVIDIA could play a major role in Arm's IPO. Keep in mind, Arm makes the uh, blueprint designs for chips and smartphones all around the world, probably in the smartphone in your hand right now, and has expanded into auto design as well as servers. It's expected to be listed in New York as early as this fall by parent company SoftBank. And so what the FT is reporting is that NVIDIA was approached to be an anchor investor. So that means taking a lead role in buying shares and building confidence among other investors. But NVIDIA's preferred valuation for ARM is in a range of about $35 to $40 billion, which is way less than SoftBank's $80 billion goal. So that means NVIDIA can't go it alone. Memory maker SK Hynix, smartphone chip maker Qualcomm, and Intel have all shown previous interest in investing in ARM in some shape or form. And so a consortium of ARM investors will not only increase the value of their relationships with ARM, but also reduce risk for SoftBank's stake post-IPO and help possibly drive this stock higher. This is according to Jeffrey Analyst in a note. And why is this? Well, SoftBank has a 75% stake in ARM with the rest held by its vision fund. A lot is on this IPO given SoftBank's uh, previous, let's say, investment missteps to be nice. But in SoftBank's public listing of ARM last May, it said ARM would continue to be a subsidiary post-IPO. Likely, that means keeping control over ARM, even with these big anchor investors. So, Kelly, there's a reason to secure NVIDIA. You guessed it, AI. NVIDIA not only drums up confidence in a tough IPO market, but makes it clear that AI is how ARM may plan to seek out growth. A little trickier for me to figure out is why NVIDIA is partnering or investing in this. Is it a biotech company today? Yeah, so the biofirm Recursion. And what they do is Recursion uses generative AI uh, to sift through all of these massive, massive data sets. And from there, they could help towards drug discovery. So they're using AI to sift through and find new uses for old drugs or uh, any type of potential drug candidates. These databases are massive. So NVIDIA's just announced that they're spending $50 million, which isn't that substantial, $50 million to gain access to those data sets. Why do this? Because NVIDIA also has a new BioNemo cloud service that they plan to license to their own customers that would get that means that NVIDIA would get access to all of that data from recursion. That's why NVIDIA is doing it. You know they're the AI leaders.